Yo, it's time for the new My GM series. Let's go! The decision has been finalized. The votes have counted up, and it's time. The team I will rebuild will be the Milwaukee Bucks. And in this team, I'm guessing the only person that's safe is Giannis Antetokounmpo, and I don't even know about him. He is too tall to play that small forward position. I'm thinking of replacing him, and I'm just looking at the injuries because I know these guys aren't gonna be the aren't gonna be injured once they start the new my GM series up. So without any further ado, let's dive into these set goals that this GM might want me to do. Everybody's getting traded. Everybody, Giannis, Craig Monroe, Jabari. I have to be a very, very good trade for me to trade them. If I'm talking about very good, I'm talking about it benefits me. And it's not it's not going to be a bad move. Because when I'm giving up something, I got to get something good back. You know, like if I give up Gerald Henderson, for example, an 80 overall. I better get back an 80 or, or higher overall player. I'm not playing with that. <laughs> but right here, we see we're down 4 million. Our team kind of strains that good. And the fans ain't that interested. So let's see what we can do to switch this team up. Let's rebuild them from the ground up. Ooh, that rhymed. And no, we're not going to rebuild the draft if we go into another year. But I am going to download the next draft class. So this is our lineup for... Without making any trades yet. Yet. Without making any trades. We have a lot of expandable pieces. Michael Carter Williams is gone. Guaranteeing it for you guys. Just watch me get a good trade off him. And the first trade for Michael Carter Williams, Miles Pumley, and two draft picks. I get Jeremy Lamb and the boy Jalen. And right here, I finished the rotation. So this is what the rotation would look like now with Jeremy Lin and Jeremy Lamb added to that. Time for the second trade. OJ, Johnny Bryant for Marvin Williams. And I can't, I don't remember the other player's name. But those two on and Tyler Hansbrough because I need an upgrade at the backup power forward position. So let's see what we can do now that we're getting this nice key upgrade at power forward to help back up Jabari. Now, I know I said I was going to trade Jabari Parker for a good price. And what's better than Chris Stapp's Godzingas and Lance Thomas? Come on now. All I'm giving up is Jabari and Steve Novak for two great additional pieces. Especially in a poor Zingo. Let's add him to the team. Giannis, Chris Middleton. I said everybody's gone for the right price. Giannis on an expiring contract. He could sign with anybody. And I honestly don't see him rocking that small forward nicely. But it was nice having him on the team. Jay Crowder and a Avery Bradley. You guys are cooking up for the Celtics. Let's take you on to our team. Jeremy Lin and John Henson. For Jordan Clarkson and Nick Swaggy P. Young on a second round draft pick that we're giving up. But hey, this is this is looking kind of lethal because Jordan Clarkson is better than Jeremy Lin. Nick Young could be a nice backup small forward if I don't pick up anybody else. Nick Young and Tyler Hansbrough are gone for Brandon Rush and Maurice Spates for an upgrade at the center position. Now we have a stretch five. And Jared Davis for Patty Mills. Good trade. So this is our lineup for the Milwaukee Bucks 2015-16 season. Could we win a ring or is it just another bust? Let me know in the description, if I mean in the comments, if everything was good. And it's your boy Jay signing off for the day. Peace.